In this video, we will go over how to change your website size. There are two options to change your site size. First, in the editor, click Settings, and then the Appearance tab. Our first option is to change the page width and height. We recommend you use a size between 940 and 1000, as this will fit on most computer and laptop screens. But of course, you can customize the site as you like. You will notice that the Keep Aspect Ratio button is checked. When you type in your own settings for height, you will notice that the width changes automatically. This is to keep the same shape of your site. If you don't want this and would like to change it on your own, simply uncheck the Keep Aspect Ratio box. The second option to change your website size is via the viewing mode in Publish, which you can choose True Size, Best Fit, or fit to width. True size means that your site's appearance will be a true reflection of the actual height and width measurements you have set, no matter what computer and browser your site's visitor is using. We recommend this, however, we offer two more options. The best fit option will scale your website to fit your user's screen, regardless of their screen size, as best we can. Some things like text may not scale as well. Here's an example of best fit. Last, the fit to width scales your website to match the width of your user's browser window, so no horizontal scrolling will take place. It is similar to best fit, except that instead of fitting all the dimensions of your site to the browser, it only fits your site to the width of the browser. Here's how fit to width looks. If you choose Best Fit or Fit to Width, be sure to check your site on different computer resolutions and browser window sizes. Now make your choice and click OK. And that's it! You've just changed the size of your website. Now don't forget to save!